than a week before Christmas, the family of Kathy Gomez is grieving her death instead of getting ready to celebrate the holiday. It's sad, devastating for the family and, you know, especially for during the holiday season, it's not. According to her family, 17-year-old Kath and Gomez and her boyfriend were walking home from this neighborhood taco place around 10 last night. Surveillance video from a nearby business shows the young couple getting ready to cross the street. Moments later, they were both lying on the street at the intersection of Pacific and Violent Avenues. Kathy died here. Her boyfriend survived. She was, you know, a great girl, a big heart, full of joy, always, you know, appreciated life, appreciated the little things we take for granted in life. Baldwin Park Police tell us the couple was in the crosswalk and had the right of way to cross when they were hit. The driver stayed and was subsequently arrested and booked for vehicular manslaughter. Kathy Gomez, according to family, was a junior at Sierra Vista High School here in Baldwin Park. This was her first year there. They tell us she and her boyfriend had been dating for a couple of years and were inseparable. The family says now that an arrest has been made, it'll help them deal with their grief. Well, right now, we don't know the full, complete story about what happened, but I'm sure with that arrest, it'll, you know, help us out. Baldwin Park police tell me it's still under investigation what happened here, but the one thing they do know is that it doesn't appear that drugs or alcohol were involved in last night's fatal collision. In Baldwin Park, I'm Sid Garcia, ABC 7 Eyewitness News.